Hey guys, Sean here at Mahalo, and today I'm going to show you how to master the start menu in Windows 7. Today we're going to get familiar with the start menu. The start menu is a jumping point for navigating and accessing everything you need on your Windows computer. Over the years, Windows has been simplifying the desktop and adding start menu features. This makes for a clean desktop and a robust start menu. To access it, just left click on the Windows logo in the bottom left of the desktop. At the top of the start menu, you should see your user account picture. And below that, you'll see recently used programs and programs that have been pinned here. To see every program, simply click or hover on All Programs. To pin a recently used program, just right click on it and then click Pin to Start Menu. Now, if you have a shortcut that is on the desktop and would like it in the Start Menu, all you have to do is simply left click on it and drag it into the Start Menu. Now on the right, we have Your Documents with Pictures, Music, and Games, then System Settings and Help. Feel free to use the Help button as it has a great search function and covers a lot of topics. Now if you look on the left, you can see some of the programs have a small arrow next to them. This is so you can easily open recent files in that program. And if you'd like to keep a file on this list, right click on it and then click pin to list. Lastly, my favorite feature of the start menu is the search function. Just type in what you're looking for and press enter to launch the highlighted item. This comes in really handy if you want to change mouse settings for instance, I just type in mouse. If I'd like to change my background, I just type in wallpaper. Now if I want to change how my start menu looks, I can just right click on the start menu button and select properties. From here I can change what the shutdown button does by default. I can also change almost all the content that is inside my start menu by hitting the customize button. Here I can select what is shown in my start menu and what is not shown. Also, if you feel like you've gotten too carried away with your start menu and would like to go back to how the start menu was, you can just hit the default settings button and then the start menu is brought back to its original state. And there you have it, you now have the ability to operate, manage, and manipulate the start menu to your choosing. If you'd like to stay connected to this learning course, make sure to subscribe and feel free to rate and comment below. Also, if you have any requests, send your requests to requests at mahalo.com. Thanks for watching.